guys, it's Roberta here, and Miss Gucci is joining me today. Um, it is very early in the morning uh, right now. Uh, it is 5.17 in the morning. I have a text message. I said, where does he keep them? She's like, let it go. I was like, what does he wear when he plays basketball? Does he wear the My friend's like playing a video game that takes place something about apocalypse or something. I don't know. Um, just watched a couple um, videos on reactions about the singer Prince um, and his death and stuff. And, uh, didn't realize that he spoke up a lot about the government and chemtrails, um, and stuff like that. And they're saying, it, when you talk about the Illuminati, sometimes it's that a couple coincidences have happened where people have, celebrities have been killed because they're speaking out against the government. But, like I said, we don't know what happened, really. Um, I will be catching the news today uh, when I, uh, at 7 o'clock to see what's going on with that. Um, but I am following that story. Um, wanted to say one thing. I did post something on Facebook, and I realized right now that I did not include Michael Jackson. Um, I had said something for um, Prince and did not include... Michael Jackson in that, um, it was by accident, because I was trying to remember, um, all the, uh, musical artists that have died, uh, past and present, um, I did include, uh, you know, I talked about John Lennon, um, David Bowie, Elvis Presley, um, and so forth, and I didn't realize I did not include Michael Jackson, um, Yes, I do like Michael Jackson, uh, but I kind of grew out of Michael Jackson, but that's not why I didn't include him. Um, I was just trying to um, say um, blog something on Facebook, and I did not include his name in there, but um, um, it's, I just find it kind of funny that there was three people, there's these people recently, Michael Jackson, and Nicole Smith, um, China, the wrestler China, um, and David Bowie, and now Prince. I do think it's kind of funny, um, they're kind of like going one after another. Also, the woman that played the mother on Everybody Loves Raymond, Doris something her last name is, I'm sorry, I can't remember her last name. And also, there was another actor that died, um, recently, an elderly gentleman that died, uh, recently, he, he was mainly guest stars on shows, and I think he did do one show in the 60s, um, it's kind of weird that they are kind of going one after another, um, this is a little funny, but, um, anyway, a lot of them have spoken out. They did say that, oh, Whitney Houston, um, we need to include Whitney Houston in there. Um, a couple actors, um, Kurt Cobain, um, you know, people like that, that, um, probably have spoken out against the government or spoken out against something, um, and they're saying this is all involving Illuminati and how, um, People are being knocked off because of Illuminati stuff. Um, this is just some random YouTube videos. Uh, some, some, I guess they're podcast shows. Um, right now I'm watching... Um, Kevin Smith talks about Prince. Um, apparently um, Prince was going to do a doc... He, this gentleman was going to do a documentary on Prince. And he was, he's explaining, um, his interactions with Prince and stuff like that, so, um, he is a comedy person, but what Prince wanted him to do was make a documentary, um, about, uh, religious subjects that, um, um to, about, uh, his, Je being Jehovah Witness and things like that, and and uh, I think that's pretty interesting and um, 
I'm not don't think it's gonna come out now being that princess passed away. Um And finally after the four hour mark, one of the guys camera guys comes over to me and he's like, We're out. So uh yeah, that's what I'm watching now. Um I watched Ghost Hunters last night. Um and by the way, he's doing this uh, talk. Uh, it's at Kent State University, so uh, that's where he's doing uh, Kevin Smith. That's where he's doing this talk from. So I'm. I i do not know if it's like just a random talk, I guess. Um, but anyway, it's. Uh, boy, it's really early, and I'm probably gonna just gonna grab something to eat right now. Um, so, uh, it ends and everyone gets up to go honestly, I'm gonna be doing a video about my dream. Uh, I had two and, uh, weird dreams. Um, I'm gonna talk about, um, obviously in another video. And and I said to her before she left. I may talk about uh, the Union Hotel, um, which we're trying to save this building. Um, it's in Flemington, New Jersey. Um, it's where, um, across the street, uh, they have an old courthouse where they held the uh, Lindbergh trials at, and they are trying to uh, destroy this building. Um, I might do a little some video on that building today, depending on the weather. Uh, this is why I need to watch the weather. Um, to see if I'm be able to talk about this building, um, and get it out there that developers want to come in and just, you know, wreck the whole place. Which I really think they should do is, uh, they did have paranormal investigators there, and you all know that I do, um, love, I'm into the paranormal. So, um, they should really open it up to paranormal investigators because they did have Weird New Jersey there and also New Jersey Paranormal there. Um, and they did get, um, EVPs and other, uh, paranormal evidence, um, paranormal sightings by people that were either former owners, workers, or whatnot. Um, and... I'm going to talk about all that, and also I'm going to do a book review on the Bible, the Prussian Bible book, um, which is the new Bible cure for depression and anxiety um, by Don uh, Colbert, MD, uh, which is this book here I'm going to do a review on. Um, and I will probably do a series where I'm actually going through the book. Um, I just thought I was going to read it myself, but then I thought, well, we can always go through the book together. And it might help somebody that has, um, depression and anxiety disorders. Um, or even just basic depression. Uh, so I figured I would do that. Uh, not on this uh, video though, and I wanted to just talk about briefly the sinful nail polish. Um, I did my toes with this. Um, I will be doing my nails with that. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna run and have some uh, have some breakfast. Today will probably just be a corn uh, a raisin muffin with butter on it and coffee. Um, so, and I did freeze, uh, I did show a video of me, f I did freeze the, um, banana bread that came in that large container, um, I did freeze it, um, for the fact that I didn't think I would eat all of that, and then I wanted to make French toast out of it once I eat my, um, French toast sticks that I have in the refrigerator, uh, uh freezer. So, right now I'm just gonna go have my coffee, and I will be back a little bit later, um, and we'll see, um, I'm just gonna review, okay, so they're doing a video on Prince versus Michael Jackson, part one, I want to review that video, and then I will be back with you, um, 
what I think about that video. Thank you.